Hello and welcome to my 16th Python tutorial. In this tutorial, we will be learning about string methods. What string methods do is, well, help you work with strings. And we know what strings are, like... Hello world. Not hello work. Hello world, yeah. So that's a string. We know what what a string is. <clears throat> oh, we can do all types of things with uh, strings, and um, the first thing that uh, I want to cover is uh, to concatenate um, strings. And that is using a plus sign. Usually plus signs are adding when we have integers or floating point numbers. But with strings, it's hello plus and oops. So as you can see, we added these two strings to together three strings sorry and we get hello world for adding them all together also we can um repeat strings so oops hello using uh oops using the asterisk like we use with multiplication and uh what that does is just repeat it however many times we type in so four times it'll just do hello 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 uh also just like lists uh let's assign hello to a variable hello equals Hello. We can look up like what's the first letter, what's the second letter. Uh, same thing with slicing. Um, unless that brought up hell. Um, but it's pretty much the same thing as lists. Although strings are immutable as opposed to lists which are mutable. Um, if you don't know what mutable means, it means it can't be changed. Uh, so if we put hello, let's uh, hello list. Let's make that equals hello. And let's make sure that was created properly. All right. So now I will show how lists are mutable as opposed to strings aren't. Now, we want to change the first letter of hello to a Z. I don't. A, a C, yeah, C. I don't know. So we want zero to be equal to Z. Uh, it gives us this error called type error string. Uh, strings do not support, um, string object does not support item assignment. All that means is you can't change a string. But in this hello list, Although I kind of mess up by making the whole thing just one string. Uh, oops. Zero is equal to cello. Oh, forgot to make that a string. Hello list. Equal to. So now we have changed it. Wait, oh. Hello, list. 
and that's equal to cello. So that's with the um, string mutability, if that's a word, I would hope. Also, there are all kinds of all kinds of methods, just like with um, classes or uh, lists. I showed you methods. So let's take our hello thing again. And um, just do a quick rundown of all of the things. And it gives you all these nice little... A list of all the methods. Ah, uh, capitalize. We capitalize the first letter. Ah, uh, center, and then we put in an integer for the width five, and that didn't really work out. Uh, but probably just because I only have hello, um, uh, oh, that count, pretty sure, is that, ah, uh, What kind of thing? Uh, oh, right. Uh, the count method counts how many times something comes up in a single string. So, hello comes up one time in hello. Uh, hello count. H-E. HE also comes up because it's in hello and so forth. Uh, oh dot find hello. We know that hello is the first uh, thingy, the, the first string. Sorry. Uh, and then we have hello dot join. But that's how about hello list. And now we have fused them together somehow. All right. Uh, don't know what happened there. Re really don't. Ah, uh, we do. What happened? L just. Um, this uh, justifies it to the left and two. That's a really big number. All right, so just made a really big space here and there's also right justification uh, instead of L just uh, left justification it's just R just um, oh, oops hello dot lower hello it's already in lowercase hello dot L rip. Um, it removes all the white space if we have any, but we don't, so it doesn't work. Oh, dot. Um, There we go. Forgetting how to spell. Ah, uh, 
that creates it into a list and splits it up by commas by default, although we can change it, but it's just one thing, so the split doesn't work. Ah. Hello is equal to... Hello, noob. Alright. Done. Split. Uh, split. Hello, noob. Separated by a comma. Amazing. Works well for a lot of things. Ah. Uh, Hello dot title right. Hello noob that capitalizes the first letter of every word in it and then hello dot upper is the last one uh and just everything is in caps so that's pretty much all the string methods that I wrote down and remembered, but I'm pretty sure there are much more. Uh, look into those. Uh, these are really useful and um, creative. You can uh, create many creative things, especially the split method very important right there gonna use that a lot in uh, function making but that pretty much wraps it up for list methods and uh, things to do with lists I will see you next tutorial